Occasionally somebody will ask me about what we think about sin in the United Methodist Church. And I think we have an approach that's different in the Wesleyan tradition, what I call the Wesleyan tradition. I prefer to think of sin as a, a state in which we are separated from God, rather in terms of particular things that we do or don't do. When we get up in the morning and we're in relationship with God and we say, God, I give myself to you this day, then when we're in perfect relationship with God, then we tend to make decisions that are based out of love, our love for God and our love for other human beings. When we're not in good relationship with God, typically then we're not in a good relationship with ourselves and we make decisions that are based more on selfishness or self-centered concerns and that's when we live more in a state of sin. In the Wesleyan tradition, of course, we always rely upon God's grace as the great antidote to sin or to separation from God. Want to learn more about United Methodist Beliefs? Visit umc.org beliefs. To find a pastor to talk to and a church to visit, try Find a Church at umc.org fac.